Hi, this is Amin and welcome to my first tutorial on Java Swing. This tutorial is going to be just an introduction. But first of all, we're not going to talk about Java Swing directly. We have to talk about something that is so important, which is the AWT. Because we're going to use it on this tutorial. And it's so important. So, what is AWT? AWT stands for Java, the Abstract Window Toolkit, and it's a part of Java designed for creating user interfaces and painting graphics and also images. And it's uh, a set of classes intended to provide anything a developer requires in order to create GUIs. And by the way, GUI stands for Graphic User Interfaces. And uh, what else? So. Uh, uh, most of the AWT components are derived from one class is the java.awt dot component and I said most of this component not all because there's some components are not derived from the, the component class just like menu bar, menu, menu item and so on so AWT it's also one part of the GFC, which is the Java Foundation classes, also Swing is a part of this of these classes. There is AWT, Swing, Accessibility, uh, and uh, Java 2D, and also drag and drop. So these are the five parts of GFC. Now we talked about AWT. We're not going to We're not going to go through details. So this this is a Java Swing tutorial, so it's not AWT. AWT, we're just gonna say an introduction to that. We're not gonna we're not gonna say we're not gonna go through details. So now we're gonna talk about Swing. Java Swing, it's a set, it's a large set of components, range from the simplest one, which is. Uh, J level to the very complex just like trees, tables and styled documents. And also uh, for swing, almost all swing components are derived from one class, one parent is the J component. J component class extends the AWT container class. Thus, Swing is best described as a layer on top of out, rather than a replacement for it. And, uh, and almost each AWT component has an equivalent in Swing, just like label we have in Swing, J label is the same name plus a prefix J. But as I said, almost. Because, for example, the AWT canvas class or canvas component has not an equivalent on Swing. But we can use the J panel, J split pane, or something like that. Just like a canvas, we can draw graphics in it, we can do whatever we want to do, just like in a canvas. But what is the difference between AWT components and Swing components? Swing components are considered as a light, a lightweight components, and AWT as a heavyweight component. What is lightweight and what is a heavyweight component? It's a matter of layering or z-ordering, but I'm not gonna go through details. So. As I said, it's just a Z ordering matter, so the difference is just C, uh, the lightweight and heavyweight component stuff. So this is all, and this the the next tutorial is gonna be our first, our actually the first Java Swing demonstration tutorial. So it's gonna be actually creating a new frame or a new window. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this and see you on the next tutorial.